We're filling up our we're filling up our rental with gas. Because that's what you gotta do. And she's getting ready for the sun. Very important to wear sunscreen. past eight days, or seven days. Eight days. Today is the eighth day. But there's our rental going back to Hertz, and here's our loaner car, because our car that we bought is in the shop. Then we're gonna go over to the experimental prototype community of tomorrow. We're gonna do a little, little thing for the Fat 5207 channel for next week's video. We're done? What? Car's returned? Yep. They didn't, they didn't make us pay for the whole car? Nope. They just gave me a receipt, and we're fine. So now we can go play? Indeed. Now we can go to the Epcot DVC lounge? Yay! And get ah! a bunch of free what coffee. Where did we get wet from? Dripping. Oh. <laughs> a bunch of free coffee and uh, pop and snacks. Look at that spaceship Earth right there. Look, we both got their security without getting nabbed for the body scanner. Should I do my Peter Rambles now or later? Right now. Right now? Yeah. Fun fact, I had a little, a little lecture course during our college program about this here attraction. It's specifically about those metal plates. So I heard a story about how when Disney was looking for contractors and vendors for materials for Spaceship Earth, that they had all these different people and this guy came out of nowhere, like this guy, this company came out of nowhere and kind of like it was like a door salesman with like a trench coat opened up it was like, what do you need? I have the best thing here. This guy walked, like came to Disney with a proposal and was like, I got this special kind of metal coating that goes on my metal plates and it's like self cleaning, self like shining, it's perfect. So Disney World was like, yeah, definitely. We need a self cleaning metal material that's always going to be low maintenance, last forever and be shiny. So, fast forward a couple years when they actually build Spaceship Earth, guess what? It's not self-cleaning, it gets dirty. There's a special team of custodial cast members. I don't even know if you'd call them custodials because they're like, probably more like maintenance, but there's like four or five uh, cast members that are specially trained to take a cherry picker from the very last room of Spaceship Earth where it's all the stars. When, right when you get turned backwards, if you look and your eyes adjust the darkness really quickly in the back corner, you can kind of see a ladder and a stand with a cherry picker up there. Very hard to see in the dark, but there's a cherry picker there. They take that cherry picker to the very tip top and there's a latch and they like open this latch and there's a little crawl space. And they crawl through the space and there's actually a hole in the very top of Spaceship Earth. And these cast members go up there and then with ropes, scale all the way down the sides of Spaceship Earth about twice a year to clean the squeegee board each one of the tiles. But we're gonna go check out Journey to the Imagination because I've actually never done it. And that's our confession. I haven't either. <gasps> I think they're closing it too. I, I think they're doing a reboot. Or are they closing... Uh, what they just announce? They're closing... We'll look it up and we'll let you know when we get there. But um, next year I've been coming here for 20 years. I've never been at this. What? And it's been open the whole time you've been coming. Imagination Institute, Aww. Inventors of the Year Award and recipient. That's Aww. super cute. I feel like we're not supposed to be in here. Yeah, I definitely feel like we're not supposed to be in here. Look at the different offices. <gasps> There's Sigmund. Oh, it's the open house. Wow. Are you super excited? Yes, I'm looking up if it's closing. This is one of our discoveries, the figment of imagination. Yeah, I know all about the senses. There's sight, sound, smell, touch, coochie coochie go, and taste. Taste my chicken. Can I go? Please, please, please. No, I don't want you out of my sight. Out of sight? Okay. Come on, everybody. Here we go. Next stop, imagination. For every sound, your ears are here. A thousand thoughts can start.
start appearing and each of us imagines different things from just the sound your mind has wings sure you can see with your eyes but imagine what you could see if you used your imagination follow the bouncing figment one spark of light can light your fence your mind sees more than what your eyes see your sense of sight can make your fancy fly there's more to sight than meets the eye what awful whip can send you reeling what lovely sniff can be appealing your mind But did you love it? I love it. That was so good. I feel like I've been missing out on it my whole life. Because I feel like I love that song. I know, we have heard the song before. Yeah. And the attraction was super cute. Yeah, that was really, really nice. I'm gonna go on that again today. Yeah. Whoa, look at this thing. So play the air. This whole area is super cool. I never knew any of this existed. And I worked right across the street. And here's the entrance to the DVC lounge. Oh my god, that worked out perfectly. Yes, so the DVC lounge, hold on, is right up these stairs. She's just relaxing. She got herself a cold pop. Mm -hmm. And her phone's charging. And a fancy loungy chair. I have an issue. What? That Figment song is stuck in my head. <laughs> That's a great song. This is by far one of the most gorgeous places I think I've ever been in. Well, Sarah's just gonna go shopping for some more DVC contracts. No big deal. Wilderness Lodge DVC units. They're so nice. I sure got the spread going on over here. Got my coffee. We came by, they came by with a cart full of snacks and we got some Cheez-Its. Sarah's over here trying to book us up some, some resorts and some dinner reservations for our anniversary next week. What? Oh, grab it. Where are we going to eat next week for our honeymoon? I mean our anniversary. Kona Cafe. If you have been to Kona Cafe, because we have not, put down in the comment section down below what we should get. Let's go on another attraction that we've never been on. Have you been on this one before? I'm not. All right, we're off to see Ellen. All right. Another first, my friend. You've never done this one either? So we're doing Universe Energy. This is leaving. We're just like World Showcase family. So we world Showcase like, plus Test Track. We would do like Test Track. Sometimes we should space. Spaceship Earth, duh. Soarin'. And really just spend the rest of the day. Yeah, but well, we're... We, we did do um, Honey, I Shunk the Kids when I was little, but we were absolutely terrified when, like, the rat tails crawled by you. And so we never went back. Ellen's Energy Adventure at the Universe of Energy. This is closing, because I know Brock and Promise from Ears to You were super bummed, because they love this. We could totally redo it with Ellen again. I know, and Bill Nye. And I'm a huge fan of both of those. Um, we're in a big room with screens. What the heck is all this? I'm gonna go Haunted Mansion style and go closer to this door over here. I presume we open through that door. You know, you're probably surprised to see me here, aren't you? 
but then there's probably a lot of places you'd be surprised to see me when you think about it. If you were driving in your car, for instance, okay? Close your eyes, you're in your car, don't close your eyes, in your car, but right now think about it. You're in your car, you're driving, and then all of a sudden in the back seat, I just pop up and go, hey! You just whack me in the head, wouldn't you? That would be, that wouldn't be nice. But then it wouldn't be nice for me to do that to you. How'd I get in your car anyway? Can you, did you lock the car? Maybe it was your fault. Maybe I'm just teaching you a lesson. Look at this. We're not supposed. We're not supposed to film. This is so big. Front row. Oh, Bill, where are you? Ow. Bill, is that you? For yet another attraction we've never been. Spaceship Earth. You're ridiculous. We've been on this like 700 times. But this just seemed to be the theme of the day and I realized that I think that there's nothing else that we've never been in. So. If you didn't know, you can do your fast pass. It's actually 15 minutes early and 15 minutes after the, like, the, section, the window of time that you book because Chelsea used to be a cast member from Desolations who told us and it's great because we got a universe of energy which was a fantastic ride um, 10 minutes after our fast pass ended. But it's good enough. Oh, that's the first time we've done that. Smile. And wait out to your guide. I mean, we're still from Chicago, but we live in Orlando now. Right? Right. Together, we form Super Network, the global billions of interactions. Once again, Side of the France Pavilion. And which and tax is right in the Artisan des Glasses? Sorry for my terrible French. How much? It was like seven. It was seven fifty with tax. It's pretty decent inside. It's not bad. Looks so different. Oh, it's I'm coming like out the backside. I might come inside. Would you get it again? Would you get it seven hundred more times? I think this is a new favorite. Here is our Spaceship Earth Sunday. Oh yeah. We're done for the day. Yeah. We're leaving Epcot. We got it Sunday. Tomorrow we got work. So we got things to do. Mm -hmm. We got a dog to go play with. Stuff to hang on our walls. Stuff to hang on the walls. This is a high class Sunday dinner. Turkey and pepper jack cheese melts. 
Booyah. And we got some pasta going. But we're being productive. We got some nice new shirts for me for work. Got some park stuff for us to be on the ready and be good park goers. Oh, I wanted to shout out to the shop that I got my um, my naughty headband from. It's from Crid, Crittier Country. And um, we oh. did like a little swap with our buttons in there. Um, headbands. So we'll put a link down nice. below. Yeah, check them out. It is late and we spent the rest of the evening uh, getting vlogs ready and hanging up stuff on the walls as you can see in the background there. So maybe we'll show you some more stuff. Uh, maybe sometime this week we have a few more walls to get set up and then we can we can share all that. But Sarah actually fell asleep after editing a, a vlog that went up later and it was a it was an early morning, it was a hot and busy day. We got a lot of stuff done as you, you saw and Epcot done, a lot of first too. But uh, we are ready for our second full week to start. I go back to, mo to work tomorrow bright and early. Thank you for following along with our, our fun Epcot day. And uh, don't forget to give us a thumbs up and subscribe and uh, get ready for more adventures every day. It is good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>